It's really starting to feel like fall. We got out the house pretty late today because we were trying to be grown ups and take care of things. And now we're just in Soho, just chilling, relaxing, making sure the Sunday doesn't go by with us staying in the house all day. I say Nutella churro, churros. Churros? I love Nutella. I love churros. That has to be something that goes on the list. What a cheat day. This place shut down a few days ago. Something went crazy with the owner and I almost lost it because all of my skincare, well, a lot of my skincare comes from here. So glad it's back open. I got my stuff. And my skin is safe. Wow. I feel like 75% of my life in New York is waiting online. We gonna jump on that? Is waiting online to get food. 75%. Actually. <laughs> All right, y'all. See you later. I'm going to meet my husband in Times Square. And any real New Yorker knows that Times Square is the worst. Wish me luck. many people. Yes, I know that sounds crazy coming from a New Yorker, but within Times Square in these this little space, there's too many, there's too much going on. That's the first reason. Reason number two, everything is extremely overpriced over here. New York is already expensive, but once you come to Times Square, it's even more expensive because they know all of you tourists over here and they're charging you way more than what we pay any place else. And number three, it's because it's not an accurate depiction of what New Yorkers feel is New York. Now don't get me wrong, it's a big part of New York, but this is not how we live. I had my, one of my husband's cousins come visit one time and she said, I don't know how y'all do this. We don't, we don't be just going around and chilling in Times Square, it's kind of the worst. If you've never been to New York and you come to visit, you have to see Times Square, but keep in mind, this is not how we live. No, I'll be there. No, I'll never forget that day. No, no, never forget that day. No, no. Thug dudes, I guess they were real hard. One sister, the other one. Yo, son, really? 
I have to fix my credit. <laughs> the other one was like, yo, I made it back. He said, I got like a 720. It's real out here in these streets when the thug is, so the thug dude is fixing their credit. I thought that was hilarious. Anyway, I'm on my way to um, Trader Joe's. <laughs> Erica Badu vibes. Carrying all them bags like that. I give up. I'm phoning it in. I cannot keep working like this. <laughs> I have to go get my nails done. Yeah, 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 I know. It's silly. But I just keep looking at them and I'm like, I can't deal with it. I know I should like not think about it and let it go. Let it go, let it go, let it go, let it go. Oh, but no. So, nails it is. So, the mystery of my nails have been solved. I know you don't care. But I do. They weren't using, and may, hopefully you're um, familiar with the SNS process, but they weren't using the full SNS system. They were just using the powder and some other random stuff. So when I inquired about it, because I inquire, Shorty said, because they're trying to save money. Excuse me? Well, wait. You trying to save money, me while I'm spending more? No, ma'am. I said, well, do you have the rest of the, of the, uh, the whole SNS thing? They said, yeah, we have it. Then you're gonna have to use that today. You're gonna have to use that today on my hands. Save money. No, ma'am. A long time ago, somebody asked me on my Instagram a while ago if I actually dress like I do in my Instagram pictures. And I was confused, but yeah, this is how I look every day. And sometimes I may do too much, but that's me. It also took me a long time to realize that it's okay. And this is just how I feel comfortable. And if you don't like it, deal with it. I didn't do much yesterday, so um, I didn't blog that much. I was really just working on my nonprofit. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you know what I'm talking about. Um, first of all, why aren't you following me on Instagram? Figure that out. And second of all, um, if you are following me on my Instagram, I'll put it in the highlights when I talk about my nonprofit and how it's um, for girls and you'll see. So go to follow me on Instagram, see what I'm talking about, see what I'm doing with my life or one of the things honestly I'm doing with my life. Um, so yeah, yesterday I just worked on that and that's boring so I didn't vlog that. But today I have a few errands and um, yeah, I need to go to anthropology because candles and fall since it got cold. So yeah, and also, no, this is not the same leopard jacket I had on yesterday, but it looks totally different. So, don't judge me. So of course, Anthro did not have the candle that I wanted. I just uh, guess he wants me to save my money. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go to H&M over here and I still have to um, do some food shopping. So exciting, my life is so exciting, guys.
either this H&M is whack, which I knew it kind of was, or I'm really not supposed to spend any money. I can't remember if these lights are always up or if they put them up for the holiday season already. I feel like it's so early, but they're up. The funny thing is that I love holidays and Thanksgiving and uh, Christmas and everything. And my husband loves Thanksgiving more than he loves Christmas, but every time we go into a store and they have Christmas stuff up already, he gets so mad. <laughs> it feels like they're disrespecting Thanksgiving, which they kind of are, but it's kind of funny. Me, I love Christmas. I just realized that I didn't end the vlog yesterday. I'm just coming on here to tell you guys thanks for watching. I'll be starting a new vlog at the end of today or tomorrow. And uh, see you next week.